Hi to everyone and welcome. If you're looking to build a professional looking working website or landing page, we want to show you today the great and fantastic platform and very powerful tool to make that happen. You can build plenty of things like portfolio, blog, online store, personal CV, creative services, events and weddings, small businesses, and so on and so on. Like this is really perfect tool to get started with if you have no experience in site building uh, and you just have an idea you can find here plenty of templates that already made and pre-built for you you just jump it in and you edit in the thing so in this video uh, i want to show you how you can by yourself very fast and easy build your own uh, web page if you have online or offline business uh, before I've started to show you all the basic knowledges uh, about site building, I want to remind that you can find the link for this fantastic service in the description panel of this video and you can easily get it with a big discount for our subscribers from all our team. So let's jump in, not wasting time and let's go to the dashboard of the Squarespace. Alrighty, to create a website before you, of course, first of all, you need to log in or sign up um, and just pressing build a website. First of all, the, mm, there are types of web pages and sites that you want to build and the topics about it uh, because you can be as specific as possible to find the correct template to not to build it from scratch it will save you tons of time and uh, tons of work so let's build i don't know something for sport um for example you have the yoga studio or you open in it uh, you just opened it for example and you don't have a web page and you need it so let's build it probably it's in the health and beauty uh, i believe that there are already okay that's that's great there's a template for yoga studio already and uh, you just need to change some things change some content to your own of course first of all you, you need to have some content uh, because if you don't have it mm, well you need to buy it or you need to create it where any web page any website contains a um, lot of content so it's like videos, texts, descriptions, and so on and so on. So first of all, you need to give your web page a name. Just continue. Uh, and the platform itself will show you how to edit, what to press actually, but we're gonna skip it. I will show it to you in this video. All right, there's also assistant. You can open it anytime. Just click in this question button. All right, there are plenty, plenty of things right away, and it's pretty well done, um, well done site web page. There are tons of information like classes, teachers, training, and journal. Uh, we're gonna change it all, uh, and if you press into pages, all you actually need. Let's start from. Uh, this left side menu all you need to build your website if you're a newbie um, like pages design and settings everything else is for the pros and uh, for promoting and marketing and so on just in this video i want to show you how to build a web page how to uh, how to make deal with uh, all the elements on it just press and add it Okay, you see there's header, there's uh, some kind of text right here, and there are pictures, like everything is pretty understandable, uh, but it's a lot. As for me, we're gonna leave just one page, um, just want to show you the case and after you watch this video till the end you will get the idea of how to build it of how to act with all these sections and elements uh, so 
the header. Let's start from the header, edit site header. You see this Yoga Studio that we gave a name for our site, it's already here. Uh, and here you can choose the logo. If you have, you can change the site title. Uh, in desktop, you can change the header layout. I want the logo to be in the center, for example, like that. All right. In the mobile, the same thing, guys. If you're making your web page, just remember that tons of traffic nowadays flows from um, mobile phones, and, um, like tablets and smartphones. So you need to, before you go live with your website, you need to check how it looks on uh, on the mobile version because it's very important for now. I want the logo to be here also. And we're jumping back. Elements. Here you can enable or disable button. You can rename the button itself. You can edit the click event. What's going to happen when somebody will click uh, on your button. He can jump into the new page, the existing page of this website. He can write you an email or make a phone call or even you can give a file to download uh, or you can relink your button to other web address. Let it be email, for example. To make this happen, you need to fulfill uh, the fields and uh, like what's going to happen. Yeah. This is email where somebody will um, send you the item. OK, the text is pretty pretty nice um, alrighty elements and colors here in colors you can um, edit the header view like transparent or it's not transparent but I like it to be uh, I like it to be transparent because it's gonna uh, use the color ham the color tham of the first section this is the first section it's white right here uh, and let's jump to uh, to like edit the section itself. This is the first section. I don't like how it looks. Uh, it's big, but I just want to show you how to edit the section and you will figure it out. And of course, you can edit it. You can duplicate. You can move it up or down or with this trash can button, you can delete it. We're going to edit this. Here you can choose the section height, it's small, medium or large. The content width is going to be small, for example, colors, content alignment, left hand, right hand in the center. The same thing with uh, with this one. All right, background. Right here, there's no image for the background. Uh, and you can upload image or you can upload a video. I want to upload an image and I'm going to do it from my computer. Okay, the image is here and you see how it looks. So we can edit it and, for example, make the first section like bigger and content alignment. If you will make it like here, it looks pretty cool already because uh, the text is on the on the white color. It's pretty readable and it's okay. So now I just want to show you how you can change the text itself and how you can um, add some things, some stuff right to this uh, section. Here you can see the plus button. You, when you press on it, you have the search content blocks and uh, all the things that you can insert here. For example, on the we have a button right here on the top, so we don't need a button right here. We can add more text or quote or image or video or anything that you want actually uh, for the first section. I believe the first section is enough, uh, like it's pretty cool looking. Just add it in the text. I want to show you how to add the text. Just double click it and you see all those things. Bold, uh, you can add a link and it's hitting one. All right, it's a big one and it's also important for the SEO when 
search engines will find it, find this tax itself. Uh, it will be understandable for the search machines that this is a heading one, like big one, okay? All right, the first section is cool. The second section, I want to delete it. Remove. And I want to show you how you can add a section. Nothing special. You're just pressing add a section and you can choose what section it will be. Headlines, list, gallery, images, quote, text, video. Okay, let's insert some image. Like that, for example. And you see there's a spacer uh, and some dummy text. Let's change an image, just uploading. Okay, that looks cool. Uh, we need to change the text here, of course, because it's Yoga Studio, it's not the something else. The text is the same, double click, and you can grab it all. You can move it with this line. Just insert in some text, uh, like random one. But of course, the text need to be uh, like the topic of the text need to be uh, specific about the about the issue that you're making the website. Of course, you can write it by yourself, or you can uh, order some text from copywriter and so on just showing you the case of how to make the things happen you see here uh, for example here the image is on the left hand and here image is on the right hand let's change this image right here okay the same thing with the text actually the text is uh, pretty okay i showed you how to change it and look here, save. The interesting thing, uh, the first section is like medium. The second section is also medium. But the color of the next section, I want to change the color of this section itself. So I need to press the edit section and I'm going to colors. And for example, I can, it's light bulb right now let's make it dark ball okay you see that looks pretty fine the next thing okay it's just a call to action so we're gonna we're gonna leave it without the changes but i want to change the color of it to light bold the next section i want to change to dark bold and here the prices uh, and so on and so on we're gonna just remove all other sections that we don't need just to show you the simple thing how you can uh make the like specific things okay and you see uh, the this picture this background picture is just inserted but not the full bleed and i want it to be the full bleed i'm pressing this button image effect you can uh even make the effects for uh apply the effects you see it's some kind of liquid film grain okay we're just gonna press none let's change all these pictures all right so we changed all the pictures uh and it looks pretty cool as for me just saving the changes so i just showed you all this stuff let's see how it looks on the mobile preview because i told you already that it should looks great on the mobile phone and you see it looks pretty cool it looks pretty nice as for me it's too much content on one page but if we're talking about the web site the big one with a lot of uh things to to discover it's okay if we building like one single landing page just to get a contact from your potential client for, from the visitor of your website 
you can like build all your page on one um, uh, on one layout. So that's pretty it. Uh, again, don't forget to save all your changes. And look here, there's a design. Fonts, colors, animation, spacing, buttons, image blocks, all you can add it right from here. I want to change font, for example. I don't like this Orpheus Pro. I want to switch it to some other font. Like it's plenty of uh, plenty of fonts available for that, and just pressing this. Um, if you want to change the font, you don't need to change the font uh, from each block. You can change it just in a couple clicks. Okay, what's happening with Sans Serif? Okay, that looks nice. And everything is on the spot and everything is pretty cool in the images and all the things. All right, saving it. Uh, so, as you can see, we spent not much of time to build a simple web page. Of course, if you want to build all the things like uh, all those pages right here, journal, training, teachers, classes and so on, if you have mm, a lot of things to uh, describe and a lot of information, of course, you need to edit all those, mm, uh, all those pages. But I just showed you the core knowledge that you need to know to maintain uh, your own web page. And when you're gonna start build your own web page, you'll find that mm, actually you can build it uh, from a scratch, uh, or you can use a template. Everything is changeable. Everything is uh, pretty, pretty easy. Um, it's drag and drop features. You can move things. You can insert things. You can upload images and videos and so on and so on. There's a lot of things to do and you can play with all these tools that are available on this platform. Uh, I hope this sounds nice. I hope this makes sense for you uh, and uh, just showed you the core knowledges uh, and the core actions that you need to make to build your own web page. Want to remind you that we left the link in the description panel of this video so you can easily find uh, the link and you can easily get uh, to the platform that we're building on. Now it's Squarespace and it's absolutely fantastic and absolutely powerful to build any web page that you want. Mm, get that link, use that link and you'll get the big discount to use this platform for our subscribers. Thank you so much for watching this video till the end. Hope this was useful and hope you enjoyed. Have a great day and see you in the next video. Bye-bye.